the roads are just covered in snow, making for some dangerous travel conditions. If you don't have to be outside and driving, please stay at home. Keep the roads clear for those essential workers out there. I'm Barangeli Lopez caught up with the Texas Department of Transportation, and she's got an update for us now on the latest road conditions this afternoon. How's it looking, Mara? Hey, good afternoon. Well, you know, it's super cold out here. The more I'm standing out here, the, the worse it gets, honestly. But, you know, as you can see around me, everything is covered in a very thick blanket of snow. The roads are pretty bad. Actually, if you're watching on the morning loop, I woke up over at the Cascades in Tyler and everybody woke up without power. So I packed up my things, went across town and here's a look at my commute from there. And naturally I, I did a time lapse from there, but I saw several cars stranded on the side of the ditch. So some good Samaritans were pulling vehicles out of ditches. Overall, the roads were all snow covered, difficult to drive on. And luckily at the time I was commuting, there wasn't many people on the road so I was able to get by slowly and safely and it gets stuck at the end there going up a hill on a neighborhood road but was able to reverse slowly and get back down the hill. Several traffic lights are without power this afternoon in the city of Tyler. If you come across one of those treat it as a four-way stop. Over in Lufkin, TxDOT crews have been working to help people after several weather related crashes occurred overnight. Our crews are working 12 hour shifts and around the clock to try to get the roadways clear and open. It's going to be a thing with Mother Nature. And as I said, she is undefeated and will always be undefeated. So we're working against her. And when this storm moves out, our roadways will be passable again. But I think everyone needs to be very cautious if they have to drive, if they have to be on the roadways. So as you can see, there are cars, you know, trying to make it slowly down these roads. So if you do have to travel, just take it slow. But I do want to let you all know about an emergency closure that is in effect over in the Lufkin area. And that's over at the U.S. 190 West Bridge at Lake Livingston in San Jacinto County. It's impassable at this time due to the heavy snow and ice accumulation. So again, that is the U.S. 190 West Bridge at Lake Livingston in San Jacinto County. But for all the latest conditions on the roads and all the latest updates, you can always head over over to our website, cbs19.tv. We're working hard to update y'all on the situation as it progresses minute by minute. You can also check out the Texas, drivetexas.org, and that's going to give you current, uh, current conditions day to day as what's going on. But for now, we've got you covered. East Texas, I'm Marangeli Lopez. Back to you, Dana. All right, thank you, Mar. Try to stay warm.